Yeah, what's going on YouTube? Check it. New clutch. Or I should say clutch handle. I like this style more than the fucking dirt bike one, because watch. See? Pop it in. Then you... Yeah, just change that. And in case you didn't know, I got a new tailpipe. I welded the shit out of it. Looks like a hornet's nest, but hey, at least it's welded. Anyway, uh, still waiting on the new engine head because uh, somehow this got chipped right here. This is the old one. Still waiting on the new one. Still got that motorcycle pipe if anybody's interested in it. If not, I will be cutting this fucking flange off when I get an actual phantom exhaust. I'll be cutting this flange to fuck off. Keeping the pipe and then taking this pipe and then re-weld it to the fucking phantom exhaust flange so that the thing looks like that. That's the way it's going to go on. Anyway, check this out. I was driving. I put mileage on my green bike. 4,996.5 miles, and before I even hit 3,996, it was on 3,994, clutch cable snapped. Got a new one. Turns out, Check this out, and I'm not bullshitting either. You can do this to any motorcycle or motorized bicycle, I should put it. Just as this, just this so is the uh, cable stick enough, okay? Now inside the fucking the kits, okay? They give you cables that's like this thin, which is fucking garbage. I'll show you what the fuck I did. Uh, let's see here. I took the throttle cable out of here, okay, and I kept the fat part that hooks up to this, or I should say it hooks up to the throttle line, the skinny part goes through here. I cut the skinny end off, okay, and I made my own throttle cables, or I should say clutch cables. There's a short one, that's a brake, actual brake cable. This is the throttle cable. Now look how much high quality that this fucking steel is. Hold on. Looking. See how thick that is? And the way it's fucking crafted. Yeah. That's from China. Same place that makes the bikes. But what grabs me is this is like 12 inches thicker, maybe fucking 8, maybe fucking 12 or 13. It's braided like I don't know how many fucking times. It take me forever to count on these braids, but this fucking shit is thicker than what the cable is that they're giving you in the fucking kits. What you do is you cut the little thin part off, keep the fat part at the end. See? Okay. And then you redo your fucking uh, thing on your fucking clutch. See what? And it grabs a lot fucking quicker now. Not that fucking, you know. I want like this to stop at the red light. Like this. And the fucking cable went. Bloop, and it broke. And I'm like, ah, oh, shit. So I'm sitting here hold, holding this. And it's all loose. And then this down here unbuckled. And I got stopped at the fucking red light. I couldn't get across the street. Because you got to have this fucking thing hooked up so that it goes in gear. It wasn't in gear, it was out gear, which means in drive gear. So, I was fucking stuck in traffic. That was fun. Came home, I switched out that throttle line fucking immediately. Still have the old junky carburetor. NT speed carb. Still working. Still got the little... Oh, yeah, prime it, prime it. Oh... And then the, uh, your adjustment, uh, needle mix screw, whatever the fuck you want to call it, intake. 
manic mechanic bullet intake, no fucking vacuum leaks, okay? Custom head and shit. Yep, and these two fans are my fucking uh, radiator. This one blows air into it. This one blows air from the top, but when you're flying, the air blows all around, keeps this fucking cylinder cool. Right now, I'm charging my battery. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. See, that's my horn. Get out of my way, nigger. Oh, yeah. Turn signal. Turn signal. Yeah. Does your bike have that? I think not. There's my battery. And there's my other two turn signals. And dirt bike light. Of course, you all seen that before. And it says, fuck you, bud. Now, this, I'll be getting this switched out and having an actual tag here. It says, Pennsylvania, fuck you, Biden. It doesn't say state license plate, thanks to uh, Bill Brake Fix. See, I had to take the dirt bike clutch off because it was fucking garbage. Plus, uh, these are more reliable because the locking pins are right here. Okay. My other one. I'll show you what was going on. Many people don't know this, but when you're popping it in, in, out of drive gear, um, I don't know where the fuck it's at, hold on. When you're popping it in and out of drive gear trying to stop at the red light and shit, people don't know this, but this is my old clutch. I took the spring out and put it in that, that clutch handle because, you know. Anyway, this was on my bike like this. Took it off. I'm gonna have to get another spring for this. But this is another reason why I took it off. See this? It was cutting into the fucking metal. This fucking thing. You popping in clutch, you popping in clutch, you popping in clutch. See, it's sawing into the fucking metal. So let's say this little holder thing right there, this part snaps off. You're supposed to just work this like a standard brake hander level, uh, leveler. I don't think so. I took this junky shit off. They sell you this online for like 12, 15 bucks brand new. But this is made out of like a cheaper fucking, uh, metal. I don't even know why they even fucking bought her. <coughs> that's where that's going. See? There's the new spring. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, daddy. <laughs> yeah, boy. She ain't running yet, but she's together. See? New tires, white walls. Got air pressure, too. See? I think when I bought the fucking, that girl's bike with the wheels and then swapped them on this, this fucking bike, I think it already, they had, uh, the tires were already fucking punctured before I brought them home. See, cause these are holding now. Yep. There's my engine. Cleaned up the spot welds on here. Did the best I could. I don't want to drill it down too much cause then it'd be air leaks. I want to see how this standard two-stroke pipe runs on here. Yeah. And I got enough rim to where the pedal bar goes past, goes past, goes past the muffler. Not smacking into the muffler like other bikes do. Yeah. Thanks for watching.